Hi, I'm Sean and welcome to this tech. Today I'm going to unbox and just have a little listen and see what these devices sound like I've been sent. Both of these products have been sent from Ordkey to review. One is a pack of the wireless sport headphones, I'm assuming they're Bluetooth. Um, doesn't say enough on the package. Um, and then I've also got a pair of in-ear wired headphones as well. So unlike my normal reviews and unboxing, I'm going to do this straight away as it is. So we'll start with the sport ones because they look most interesting. Now this is actually, unlike all key products normally, it's wrapped in a you know, shrink wrap. So I've got the old knife out and this one, I think. See if we can get in there. I don't know when Orky started putting plastic around the products, but there's, there's a couple I've seen now where this has happened on. Okay, and then it's back to the nice cardboard box that Orky loved to, um, to package their items in. So let's see how we get them. It looks like we're going to have to cut through this. Okay, let's see what we have. Okay. Move it up. And it looks like we've got two boxes inside. So let's see. And where do we start? A small box. Nope. Might be the bigger one. There we go. Right, we've got one part out of the box. Just there. And then we have a second little box. And that's all we have in there. Nothing else. I do generally love Rocky's packaging. They keep it nice and simple. I don't know what's with the plastic recently. I prefer just the nice cardboard boxes. But, oh well. Let's give, um, let's see what that's so. So we'll go with the small box first. I don't know why I picked that one, but we'll, let's go for it. And in here we have a USB to micro USB cable. So this must be the headphones themselves. Now I am not a sport person in this lighter, um, but what I will be doing is I'll be getting my partner, who yeah, loves to run, so I'll be getting him to go out and run and see how they work when they're out and about. Right, that's what we have. Right, let's run your box. Okay, as usual, we have uh, the Ordkey warranty card. And then we have the user manual itself. And in this case, it's in um, five different languages. Okay. So I don't know how it is, but I have another brand of earphones, but they're not quite as twisty as these. <laughs> I guess the uh, twist will straighten out over time, I guess. So I don't know how they go, I don't think this way. Well, I guess so, I guess so. That's how it seems to fit. Seems to fit quite nice actually. Let's have a look around the devices first. So Oki logo. In both parts. Now, what else do we have on these? I don't know what it looks like the microphone. Right, on this side here we have the volume rocker. And on the other side of there, we have, we have another switch, which I'm guessing maybe it's playing, and I guess it's playing pause on the other side. Just there. Um, and then I do have a little bit of vomit, I'm assuming that's going to be. Micro USB charger. Micro USB charger. 
And on the other airport, let's have a look what we have. Nothing. Nothing at all. Producing quite well made. I love the plastic feel to them. It's not, it doesn't feel cheap. I'm quite, I'm quite surprised that when I first pulled it out and saw this spriggy thing here, I thought, mm, this isn't going to be very good. But I'm actually liking the look of it. Um, See, I use sport headphones, but I use them for listening to audiobooks in bed. And this might be an option actually for me. Because um, the ones I have have very thin wire between the two, and I get tangled up very easily. So I guess we need to have a look and see if we can listen to it, I guess. So I have no idea how to use it. I don't need the manual first, so what you're seeing is how it is. Let's see, I'm going to guess. Let's see how they fit first of all. It looks like they fit this way around. Let's like this. I'll tell you what. They're actually very comfortable. We'll have a look from the back side. I like the blue anyway, it's a good colour to have. Um, so, let's see if we can make these power on. I'm pressing the, the single I was pressing the single button that was on the other side by the charging port. And that has, yep, that's activated them. Now let's just get a phone. And let's see if we can fair to them. Okay, so this time where I held the power button on and held it down continuously after it beeped, made its power on sound, and then it made a single peep. So I'm hoping that will now pop up. There we go, so my device is now showing um, board key EP813, I think it says in there. So we'll connect to that. There we go, and it's straight away paired for, for phone and media audio. Okay, so let's try this. So, Good. Let's try these volume controls. The volume control on here isn't changing my Android's volume, so it's a separate independent volume, which I actually prefer. I like this because I tend to have my audio on my phone set to full and then I've got easy adjustment on the headphone themselves. Let's just see how loud these go. Bear with me a second. Very impressive. Okay, let's just stop there. Oh, that's brilliant. I'm, I'm not going to try the minute phone call. I'm going to judge by the call I just heard that they're actually going to be just as good for a phone call. They say they are connected with the community and calls. Um, Okay, and one thing I've just noticed now on the game space, there is a little blue fashioned LED on the inside, obviously, it's a little bit of a 
Uh, we'll, we'll guess that power blue changes colour when the battery works. But what I'll do is I will come back to these in, in a few weeks' time and I'll let my partner do his running with them and see what he thinks of them because he's a sports person. And you know, if he doesn't like them or he doesn't use them, I just found a really good pair of headphones to lay out me and Bowie listen to all your books because these are a really beautiful sounding. Okay, let's just have a little look how, how we can try to do Find which headboard headphones on and uh, it's on this one. Let's see how, how simple that is to actually connect. Uh, where's the USB? The USB cable it came with. I was going to unwrap it and see how it fits. Yep, yeah, that fits in there nice and easy. In fact, what we'll do is we'll just test and see what happens when, when we plug into the charger. Pull up another OK product here actually. I've got a review coming on this shortly. This is an OK uh, 6 pulse USB pod um, with quick charge. The reviews come very shortly. Let's uh, actually use this and plug this in and see what we get. Um, and yeah, then straight away there on the headset itself. And you can see it's big white it turns into the red lights to have a bit of charging. Which I assume is, uh, I'm assuming that's going to go out once, uh, once this is the charge cycle. Okay, so spec wise, um, these are the, the OK EP813 series headphones, small headphones, uh, and they're wireless so using Bluetooth. They use the 4.1 standard um, ATTP to the movie piece of they have a high clarity sound with noise cancellation technology. I don't know how this works. I don't know if it's passive or active technology. I haven't even found the microphone on this to be honest, but we'll find out. I'll call a partner when he goes out and run with his own and we'll see what the battery is like and noise cancellation. Um, they specified they have an eight hour charge time, sorry, talk time, with 160 hours of standby time on a single charge. Um, you can also connect two devices. Now that's not, maybe not applicable for some use into running their sports. Or maybe it is, maybe you can have a tablet in your bag and your phone in your pocket. I don't know. Um, but I know for myself, I love to lay in bed, listen to an audio book on my phone, and I can use my tablet and have the audio from that too. So I, I like to have two devices connected by the to to make them feature. Now on iOS, apparently you can also see the battery in the footage how much battery is there. It doesn't, doesn't mention anything about that happening on phone. It doesn't say anything about the phone. So obviously that's what you get in the box, as well as the USB cable. Again, you get the warranty card to so register with or key. You get an extra, um, so in total six pairs of board sizes. Um, so there's two that are on already and a pack with four more inside of. Um, and then obviously we have the user guide as well. So that is the Ord Key EP813 series wireless headphone. This is the EP C2 headphones. That's all it says on the box really. Um, it has got a load of specifications in the back but I can't see them very easily. I even love the eye, I've got them in front of me. So again, I've got a little bit of little like, sensitivity seals to break. Actually got the old key logo behind there as well. Okay, maybe that's the reason why they're wrapped up so well is because of Authenticity, I think. Right, so this should be a nice simple unwrapping and unboxing because I'm sure you don't get much more than just a verse. Okay, maybe do. Nothing else in the box there. Right, let's have a look at these headphones. 
Okay. So I'll go with my traditional roots of things. So we have the user manual. And this is in six languages. And then we have the all key warranty card as well. So this is also, I believe, once you register with them, you can also go ahead and re review the products for yourself on the OK website. Okay, so inside of here, we got a plastic bag. Let's have a look what we get. Oh, we have another plastic bag. Okay, so that is extra different size earbud tips and the headphones themselves oh they seem oh they're metal bodies didn't expect that most headphones are plastic <laughs> let's uh, just undo the cable tight see what we've got So we've got a nice length of cable here. Then obviously this is a little connector belt where it splits off to two sides. And then we've got only a single button on here. So I don't know if that, I think that must just be for answering and distancing calls. Unless there's a way you can hold this for uh, changing tracks. And the headphones and snarls have a look. They're fantastic for design. Let's just put them from this camera so you can. Oh, great little design, I love it. It's got this little, little twisted metal design on the inside of each piece. Okay, so let's have a little listen to what these actually sound like. So I'll plug them into this temporary phone music. I can't see indication to which is meant to be left or right on the, in the oh yes I can, sorry. Right on the top of the headphone it says, oh, that is the right, I said all oh, and left. Okay, let's give these a shot. First of all, the buds that are on them to begin with, or quite a nice fit. Let's see what else we get in there. I do like a slightly smaller one for some reason, I think might be better. I do have smaller ones in there, and some medium. Looks like there's quite a few pairs in here. I'll come to the specifications in a while though. Let's have a listen. Yeah. Very good. Just turn that down a minute. To be fair, um, th this sounds absolutely fantastic, as you'd expect. I find these days it's very hard to find really bad headphones anyway when it comes to wired headphones i think most of them out there are really good i've tried some really cheap options in the past and been quite impressed these have just fantastic sound quality and as well as that i just like the, the build of them the metal body is just it's a great little feature having that i like, can feel really sturdy um Oh, I'll give these a long-term test and we'll come back to these in the future and 
what we'll do is a little comparison between some other white headphones and compare. Fantastic. So, yeah, that's, they sound absolutely amazing. So these are the Ord Key um, EPC2 headphones. I didn't try the button out, sorry. I, I guess that's for answering calls, so I'll read up about that and put it in the description anyway. Um, yeah, nicely decent amount of cable. Feels sturdy, it's not cheap quality cable, it's nice quality. So yeah, a good pair of headphones from what you do. So the EPC2 headphones. Um, they have noise isolating in ear headphones with inline remote and mic. Um, for clearer sound, mid-range and bass. Uh, custom fits to include small, medium and large ear tips. And they're very effective at managing ambient noise, ranging from various frequencies, apparently. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you'd like to get more content like this. And also check out my social media links down below. Thank you for watching this tech.